how to unlock the bootloader of any Xiaomi phone which is based on MIUI 11. So hello and welcome to Crack Suite YouTube channel and today in this video I'm going to show you how can you unlock the bootloader of your any Xiaomi devices which is based on MIUI 11. And in this video I'm going to use this Redmi Note 8 and I'm going to unlock the bootloader of this Redmi Note 8 which is based on MIUI 11. So without further ado, let's get started. Before proceeding to the video, one small request guys, if you haven't subscribed to our Cracksuite YouTube channel, then please subscribe to our Cracksuite YouTube channel and hit that notification bell as well. That will be very helpful for us. And if you have any kinds of queries, suggestions or any kinds of problem, then please comment down below. And if you have any kind of suggestions for this channel to make it better, then please give your suggestions and tell me on what things I need to do improvement. Either if it's on video quality or audio or in my accent or any of your personal suggestions will be very helpful for me to give you better genuine and qualitative videos and also tell me on which topic you are interested to watch videos in this channel feel free to give your suggestions to me i really need your guidelines and i'll be very helpful and happy to see your comments ideas advices and suggestions so please comment down below and okay now let's begin to our topic and now let's unlock the bootloader of redmi note 8 which is based on miui 11 so let's start the first thing that you have to do is to sign in with your MI account on your mobile phone and it's better if you sign in with the mobile number that you have on your phone right now. And I've already logged in with my Mi account now simply click on that Xiaomi cloud written there at last. Now enable this sync from the notification panel as I've already enabled it as you can see here on the screen. And now scroll down a little bit and click on that sync right over there. And it will sync all of your data. So now it's synced. Now go back and make sure your fine device is on. And I've already enabled it. And in case if you haven't enabled this fine device option, just enable it. And now go back and go back again. And go to the about phone section and tap on MIUI version about 7 to 10 times to enable the developer option. And now our developer option is enabled. So now go back. Now scroll down and go to the additional settings. And again scroll down and go to the developer options. And here make sure developer options is enabled. And also enable this OEM unlocking. Here you have to draw the pattern. And click on enable. And now our OEM unlocking is enabled. Below OEM unlocking there is MI unlock status. So just click on it. And click on the agree button. And you can see here the device is locked, the phone is secured. That means our phone's bootloader is locked. So now we have to click on that add account and device. So just click on it. But when you click on it, you will see a pop up message and it's written there turn off Wi Fi and add your account and device using mobile data. So now you just have to turn off your Wi Fi and turn on your mobile data. And make sure you have turned on your mobile data from the same SIM card which is connected to your MI account. I mean, you have to enable your mobile data from the same SIM card you used to create your MI account. And in case if you got an error like could not verify, sign into your account again and start over, then what you have to do is you have to simply sign out to your MI account from your mobile phone and sign in again using the mobile data from which you have created your MI account and do all the process again as I mentioned earlier and come back to the developer option and click on MI unlock status. And now you can see I'm in developer options right now and I have repeated all the process again and sign into my MI account using the mobile data and now I will click on MI unlock status and I will click on this add account and device button again and now it won't show any error and you can see here added successfully and my account is associated with this device now. Also there is warning written there, don't disconnect from the network, do not sign out of your MI account, do not perform your factory reset or erase your system data. So now our work in mobile phone is done. So now simply power off your phone and then go to the fast boot mode by pressing the power button and the volume down button simultaneously, then you will be redirected to the fast boot mode. So we are in fast boot mode right now and now simply connect your phone to the computer or laptop with the help of data cable and then go to the computer. So let's go to the computer. So we are in computer right now and here you have to download this ADB setup from the description below and download on your computer. So right click on it and click on run as administrator. And then press Y and hit enter button. Press Y and hit enter button again. Press Y and hit enter button again. 
and now click on next and click on finish and ATP drivers are installed on our computer. Now we have to download MI Unlock tool. So for this go to your any browser and search for MI Unlock tool on Google and go to this link and click on this download MI Unlock and this will download MI Unlock tool in GIF format. So simply download it. Now it's downloaded so just click on it and click on show in folder. It's in GIF format so we have to extract it. Right click on it and click on extract files. I'm using WinRAR extractor and click on OK. And now it's extracted so now simply open the extracted folder and then click on MI flash unlock application. So simply right click on it and click on run as administrator and then this kind of page will appear so simply click on agree button and then you have to sign in with your mi account and remember you have to sign in with the same mi account that you have logged in on your mobile phone so simply sign in here checking mi account permissions phone is connected and there is warning written there unlock will erase user data so make sure you keep the backup of your phone before proceeding to the unlocking process and then click on that unlock button and here also the same warning and wait for 5 seconds and click on unlock anyway and again you have to wait for 5 seconds so just wait and click on unlock anyway now the unlock process is starting and the percentage is increasing as well and i know the percentage will stock at 99 percentage because when you try to unlock the bootloader of your phone for the first time it will stock at 99 percentage and give you some waiting time period as you can see could not unlock please unlock 168 hours later so we have to wait for 168 hours that means we have to wait for a week and remember in between the waiting time period you should not do factory reset you should not erase your system data you should not sign out your mi account from your phone so you have to remember these things so now i will come back after one week so see you after one week one week later it's been a week and now i'm in my mobile phone back again so now what you have to do is you have to simply follow all the steps that you have followed earlier on your mobile phone. So do follow all that steps again and then go to the fast food mode and then connect your phone to the computer or laptop with the help of data cable and then go to the computer. So I have followed all the steps again and now I'm going to the fast food mode by pressing the power button and the volume down button simultaneously and I'm redirected to the fast food mode. So now I'm going to connect my phone to the computer with the help of data cable. So simply connect your phone to the computer with the help of data cable and then go to the computer so let's go to the computer so we are in our computer back again here what you have to do is you have to simply open that mi flash unlock tool extracted folder that you have extracted earlier so simply open that folder and open mi flash unlock application so run as administrator and then click on that agree button and then sign in with your mi account that you have connected on your mobile phone now it's checking for MI account permissions. Phone is connected and there is warning written there unlock will erase user data. So now simply click on that unlock button and wait for 5 seconds and click on unlock anyway. And again wait for 5 seconds. Click on unlock anyway and you can see the percentage is increasing. Also there is blue tick on verifying device. And now it's an unlocking process. It's 90, 95, 99 unlocked successfully. So finally we have unlocked the bootloader of our Xiaomi phone which is based on MIUI 11. And at the same time you will notice that your phone will reboot. So our work in computer is done. So now let's go to the mobile phone. The phone is rebooting and this will take some little bit of time. So I will fast forward this process. Reboot process is completed. You can see the MIUI 11 logo as well. Now simply connect your phone to the network and activate this device by logging with your MI account. So this is the simple basic boot setup. So I will fast forward this setup as well. So finally we are in our mobile phone back again. So this is Redmi Note 8 and without doing any delay I will directly show you that the phone's bootloader is unlocked. So for this I will go to the settings section and then go to the about phone section and I will tap on MIUI version about 7 to 10 times then I will be a developer then go to the additional settings 
and go to the developer options and inside the developer option you can see there is unlocked return there in mi unlock status and when you click on it you can see the device is unlocked that means we have finally unlocked the bootloader of our xiaomi redmi note 8 which is based on mi ui 11 and you can use this method to unlock the bootloader of your any xiaomi phone so this is the redmi note 8 and in this way you can unlock the bootloader of your any xiaomi devices so that's it for today i hope you understand how to unlock the bootloader of your any xiaomi phone and i hope you like this video as well and if you like this video just let me know hit that like button comment below if you have any kinds of queries suggestions or any kinds of problem share this video as much as you can and don't forget to subscribe to our crack Sweet youtube channel and hit that notification bell so thank you for watching this video and see you in my next video until then goodbye and take care